And tell us a bit about the, the sort of local area. I mean, obviously this building's rooted in, 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 in the history of Edinburgh's old town. Does being here sort of um, uh, give you certain benefits or certain advantages? I mean, I'm, I'm guessing it must be very good for passing tourist trade, must be. Yeah, absolutely. In the summertime, especially through festival, you know, we're just right in the hub of everything. Um, we're very, very close to the Scottish National Museum, you know, and obviously that's quite a good feature as well. Um, obviously around us it's a big university area with a place that got bars quite close to it, you know, named after what the students are supposed to study, like doctors. And, um, but it's, it's such a great little part of, of town, so you're within like two minutes down to the grass market. You know, it's, it's in a, a location where it's away from the busyness, so um, you're not, you know, tripping behind people, I suppose, you know, at least you come up here and it's a bit of calmness as well as so say you walk up through your little courtyard into the courtyard it's just it's a big space you never think actually existed you know and then you come in you just look around you're in awe it's like what is this building all about you know you walk in you see the crystal chandelier so it's a wee bit different you know than your normal off the street you know restaurant so um, and plus I think the quirkiness does add lends itself to it and say the good selection of wines that we offer as well and obviously the cocktails and whiskies you know it's somewhere you sort of think okay I'm going to hide here and get away from the, the usual um, crowds of people that actually do frequent, you know, obviously the streets of um, Edinburgh as well. As I said, also during the festival, I mean, obviously Bristow Square is a hop, skip and a jump away, and that's quite manic and quite frenetic, and people must be able to just sort of come in here, slip into the courtyard, and there must be quite a sun trap, I imagine. It's a little bit of a sun trap out there, and especially in August, you know, you're going to see quite a few stars hanging around the hotel, so we do quite well for some of the comedians, you know, if, if you're well, well versed in your comedians in the circuit, you'll spot one or two in our courtyard especially to late at night um, and obviously it's one of those hidden hotels that's sort of off the off the map so you will find the other odds that they have you know hanging out because it is hidden away so if you do want to spot somebody you know by all means you know sit in the courtyard sit in our whiskey snow you know and you'll soon see somebody hanging around that you've got I can, I can put a name to that person you know <laughs>